All right, so I got my Gen Air old school grill here. Back in the day, it was a very expensive grill and I stopped using it, hadn't used it in about 10 years. So this is what it looks like. The burners still look pretty good. And uh, I'm gonna try to clean it. And so this is the before. Looks pretty good on the outside, but the inside, it's kind of rough. So this is the before and I'm gonna do an after. And here's the grills. All right, so let's clean this puppy up. So we about have the grill all cleaned. We've been using the power washer over here, which you just about almost need a power washer to get these old grills clean again. But these, uh, I don't know what you call them, I think they're diffusers. I think this was the Gen Air's claim to fame when this grill came out. And I think that's what most grills use today, but the burners go under this. And when you're cooking your meat, the drippings fall onto this and you know the it sizzles back up on your meat so these things are real rusty and what i'm doing is i'm using a i'm using just a regular drill like this nice milwaukee right here with a, a wire wheel brush on it and uh, i'm getting all the rust off these wheels like that right there so that way and then i'll go back and i'll clean them again with some uh dawn and we're using yeah we've been using the dawn power wash on this and uh the dawn power wash has just been amazing so let's go ahead and get this thing cleaned up and i'll show you the finished product 
All right, guys, what's up? So it's the first time this old school Gen Air grill has been used in over 10 years. Let's do this. We got some temperature on that thing. Yes, sir. Look at this ribeye steak, nice and thick. We're gonna throw her on there. Holy crap, look at that. Watch this right here. Right there she goes. Oh, yes, sir. That's gonna be something good right there. Let's close it up and let her cook. Woo! There you go.